after he wrestled all last year with a torn meniscus. Uh, what was that like? And yet you were still, I mean, one of the top placers in the state. You were fourth. Mm -hmm. uh, it was really difficult because, uh, I mean, it was kind of holding me back a lot in a lot of my matches. Um, but I guess it kind of made me tougher a little bit too. Like I was just like beginning of the season, like it was like unbearable. Like I would like had to take injury time for like a few minutes every single time it happened. And then after that, like I just like kept like towards the end of the season, I was just like hitting it back in and getting up and wrestling. And um, so I mean, it was it, it was holding me back. But I'm really looking forward to this year now that I'm healthy and I can um, see what I can do without the tormentuses. Do you even, I mean, do you notice the difference? I mean, a glaring difference other than the pain part of it? Um, as far as movement and other things? I knew off of bottom, I could only really do one move or else um, I, it would like lock up on me. So it's gonna definitely, I struggled off bottom a little bit last year. So now I'll have more freedom on bottom and on top. Um, just wrestling on the mat, I'll have more freedom to do more things like get in uh, funky positions and be able to scramble around without um, worrying about that. How anxious are you to get back on the mat without the pain of dealing with that and, and being able to actually concentrate on the match, especially early on in the season? I'm really excited. Like I wrestled down at Super 32 and um, I felt great down there and I wrestled really good. Um, so that got me really excited about the season and um, gave me some confidence going in that now I'm all, I have no health problems. So now I can just focus on um, technique and working hard and uh, ending up at the top of the podium.